Today's creature of the day is the Diprotodon. Its name means two forward teeth, named for the pair of prominent chisel-like incisors that jutted from its lower jaw. It lived from 2 to about 0.4 million years ago, during the Pleistocene, in Australia, and it was the largest marsupial ever, at 3 meters or 10 feet long, 2 meters or 6.6 feet tall, and up to 3.5 tons, or 3,500 kilograms. Its closest living relative is the wombat. It had stump-like limbs, strong claws, and fur like that of a horse's. Its rodent-like incisors helped it to browse for vegetation as it had to eat 100 kilograms or 220 pounds of veggies every day. These incisors, however, never stopped growing. Diprotodon lived in grasslands and woodlands and had seasonal round-trip migrations to track food sources. These round trips were 200 kilometers or 124 miles, approximately. It was hunted by things like Megalania and Quincana, along with early humans. Due to human hunting and droughts becoming more common, Diprotodon went extinct. It was described by Richard Owen in 1838, and there's only one known species, Diprotodon optatum. In media, it's appeared in Once Upon Australia, Megafauna, What Killed Australia's Giants, Australia, The Time Traveler's Guide, Prehistoric Planet Ice Age, Jurassic Park Builder, and Jurassic World The Game. Well, that's the largest marsupial to ever live, and one of my favorite Australian animals. Well, be sure to like, subscribe, and comment what other creatures I should talk about.